Yeah, these things are annoying. How do I get out of here, though? I wonder if there's a way to, de to see them. Maybe a spell. There's usually spells for everything. Oh. Look at that. Wait, wait, wait a minute. It could be a, a an invisible wall. Since, you know, these guys are... Invisible. And we found an invisible floor. That could be an invisible wall. It'd be certainly in, in, in line. And it is. I was right. And didn't even need to read the messages. Because they I, I noticed them when I was like, oh wait, invisible wall. And then I, I looked at the messages. Yes. Um, hi, excuse me, what are you reading? Well, look at you. We don't receive many visitors. I presume you are uh, tarnished? What brings you here? Oh, pardon me. It's hardly my place to ask, is it? I am E.G. A blacksmith who once served the Karian royals. An old codger who refuses to retire his rusty hammer. So here I am, still quietly plying my trade on this spot. Perhaps you'd like a display? These bones are old, but still able. Yes, I would. Strengthen my armaments, please. In the shape of not having smithing stones level 5. That's the shape. This thing... Oh, he's gonna smash. He smash. He smash. He does, he does the... The... I forget the name of the giant in the in Dark Souls 1, specifically. And the, the DLC also had a giant. But either way. Yeah, we can't do anything here. We can improve other things, but that's fine. Can I purchase things? Yes, I can. Some are smithing stones. Not too shabby. They are very expensive, though. Please take care. Oh, watch out there. When I'm absorbed in my smithing, I lose sight of all else. If you come too close, I'm apt to cause you harm. I am, after all, terribly large compared to you, Tarnished. You don't know how hard it is not to break anything while I work. Brave Tarnished, a word of warning, if you please. This territory once belonged to the Karian royal family. Their manor lies not far beyond this point. When the Rhea Lucaria Academy turned on the Karians, the Knights of the Cuckoo descended on this tract. After leveling it, they carried on to the manor. The Karians were taken off guard, but their strength had not waned, and they repelled the Knights' onslaught by conjuring an enchanted snare that remains potent to this day. That is why I say, Tarnished, don't go near the manor. Unless you wish to lie with the corpses of the heedless knights of the Cuckoo. Mm. I've explained the peril of the enchanted snare that remains at the Royal Carrion Manor. Whatever you do, Brave Tarnished, stay away from that death trap. Blade sent me. Blythe actually did that, did he? Quite a rare occurrence for such a guarded soul as he. Perhaps he sensed something unusual about you. At any rate, if you're friendly with Blythe, I've something else that might suit you. Oh, it's news. Think. Oh, what the hell? Karin filigreed crest lowers fart points consumed by skills. It's unique, so I'll take it. I'll see you later, I suppose. Hmm. He hurts me if I'm too close? I don't think he does. I think that's just fancy text. I can definitely see the writer being like, Oh, wouldn't it be cool if I made a character who hurts you if you were too close? And then the testers and the scripters and level designers and everybody being like, No, no, it would not. It would be bad. But the writer was like, Oh, but I've written already. And the, the talent has already written... Uh, 
you know, the, the, the actors have already said all the things. 25,000 for level up. That is quite a lot. I did not expect to be that high. Um, and, uh, and so, yeah, that, so there lays the gar, the, the thing. Where's the snare that you talk about? Is it like a drum snare? Because, you know, or is it like, oh, 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 well, it is something. Oh, it broke the thing. There was a fence here. Oh, 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 oh. Well, that's dodgeable. Let me try it again. Oh, yeah, so easy. So I know where it comes from, and of course trees will fall down. I don't even need to do much. I just need to just sort of, like, dodge to the side a little. Or do this. Yeah, just go sideways. <laughs> terrible, terrible serpentine. Or not terrible, yes, terrible serpentine. That's what I'm potentially doing. But terrible snare is what I meant to say. Although the horse probably has an easier time with this than I do. This is a lot less dangerous, let's be honest, than the Tower of Madness. And I didn't have any giant telling me about the Tower of Madness. I wonder if I missed an NPC that said something about that. Because we did see another NPC that mentioned it, right? After? Oh, rats! Don't mess with rats. Never mess with them. The big ones are not particularly more dangerous, mind you. Although they are the ones that hit me. This one is actually quite big. Alrighty. Golden Rune 2 1. Golden Rune 3 1. What is that one? Golden Rune 1 1. 3 1. Eh, it's just the usual. 3 1 over here. Um, the usual sort of fair, I suppose. 4 1 and 5 1. Oh, it's kind of sideways. Yeah, it comes from a single point. It's not like coming from above. I see. Oh, that doesn't even do that much damage. I don't know if it is coming from a single point. It is, however, rather easy to dodge. By the way, oh, this is uh, this is one of the ashes. By the way, I've been thinking. I've been thinking. I, and I think it is possible to tell. Oh, next time. That bacon. Ash of War or Frost Stomp. Uh, stomp. Wow. Yeah, we need to mess with the Ashes of War some more. I think. No, I, I get I get all this. Uh, why why do they name? Why do Japanese companies name their games the way they do? Like everything has to be of twos. They might as well just use the original Japanese names. I bet they sound a lot better than just Ashes. It's just so obtuse. I have no idea what an Ash of War is. Oh, and this is the bridge that we saw from below. Nice. Oh, I should know what an Ash of War is. I think I know what it is. It's a, it's an ability. But is it connected? To, it's an ability connected to the to the item that you have, or is it something else? I don't remember. Either way, the point is, my point is, it might be possible to tell before you kill one of the balls if the ball is for a skill or for uh, Estus Flask, because you can tell uh, the one for Estus Flasks. If they're for blue Estus flasks, uh, oh, this is this is this is worrisome. This is quite a worrisome. Do we actually go above? I don't think we do. No, it's too too tall. Um, almost, but no, not really. Uh, but yeah, I've never really paid attention 
Because I know I've seen balls be all red. And it, we've seen them also be blue. But I don't know if they're like pink or whitish for the ashes. Maybe gray. So it might be that I just haven't been paying attention. And I, I do go after, after as many balls as possible. Precisely because I know some of them give me skills. But if I can tell from below, before, then I can make my life easier, I suppose. I also don't know what that ball was. The, I, was the first one that we found of that sort similar? I wonder. I like all stony. Maybe that's all that, that it is. If the ashes, uh, if the ball is, uh, instead of being red, is all stony. I'll pay attention next time. We're by the castle. It's a big tower out here. They have names for these towers over here, the ones that are connected with the uh, with this little thing that also itself has a name. Although this one might be an extension of the wall. It is not! Oh, did they make it? Like, historical thing. No, they didn't. It is just a corner. Okay. Historically speaking, castles would have, in Europe anyway, um, they would have, like, just an, imagine an, like a square curtain wall. And just, like, you know, the square plan, floor plan or whatever. And then at each corner, you'd imagine you just have one of these bastions or one of the big towers that aren't technically bastions because they're not part of the wall itself. Bastion would have to be a part of the wall. That's, I think, the technical term. But for defending... Oh, this is going to be quite a lot more complicated. Did you get killed by this? You do not. Hmm. Still. Um, yeah, those... Uh, so what they would do is they would they would build a, 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 a tower off the... To, off to the side from the main castle and connect it with a, with a, a wall. Just literally that. So you could get, go to the tower without leaving the castle. Uh, and those th and all those things have names, and I forget them, because they're all special names that only apply to medieval castles from Europe. This is lovely. Lost Grace discovered, and rested at as well, please. I didn't join the corpses. Caria Manor. It's this big thing. No, you haven't been upstairs either, and there's ruins upstairs. Huh. I hear things. Oh! Crap. That's what I heard. I didn't know it was this. Hmm? Oh, that is unpleasant. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay. All right. I'm gonna heal Somber Smithing Stone too. Are they in the trees? They are. They are, mm, well, potentially m more than just in the trees. The second question is, are they everywhere? So now I know where to look, but yeah. Wow, this place looks great. Oh, I love it. Hi. <laughs> that fella just came in swinging. It was like, I am not dealing with your crap. A Glintstone Craftsman's Cookbook 6, one. Uh, yes. Yes, please. Uh, actually, you know what? That particular cookbook might actually tell me about the Karia place. I don't know where it is. It's fine. I hear lots of thudding. I'm not a big fan of thudding. Oh, 
All right. Yeah, so the one of the hands has fallen already from above, and this is going to be something to explore. Let's go back downstairs. Although... I... This is... Did they both fall? No. Did, none of them fell. I see a little hand. Maybe a couple. Maybe they're making the same noises. I mean, they would be tons. They, they would be very heavy. Even if they were made of flesh. Which I don't think they are. I saw you. Okay. Lucky there. Was that the middle, middle finger? He... Uh, the hand? The hand's middle finger does the thing. Which is the, the one that has the ring, admittedly. But still. Oh, there, there they are. The smaller little ones. They don't have rings. Oh, interesting. I like that there's a difference in design. Oh. I really do like that there's a difference in design. Because otherwise... I would have criticized it. I've been I've seen too many games where they just change the size of an enemy and be like, okay, that's multiple enemies. And uh, obviously they have different attacks and stuff like that, but but yeah. Oh! Oh! Crap. Okay, stop it. Trying to kill the little one first. Keep forgetting that that one is a uh, charge attack. It really doesn't look like one. It lo just looks like a. Ooh, that's interesting. Oh yeah, we saw that before. If we attack them at the same time as they jump at us, we just go under, under them. That's that's pretty awesome. There's a ball somewhere in here. There's a big hand over there. I don't think I see the ball anywhere, so I'm good. Counter attack there. That's why it did so much damage. It's a power attack there. Again, why it did so much damage. And let's get you here. There's two of them. Actually, there isn't. That one does look big, though. There's too many fingers. I mean, there's too many fingers either way. Did I stagger it? I don't think I did. Oh crap. Crap, I couldn't I couldn't lock on. I hate I hate that it works like that. Killed it. I hate that you can't disable the center camera. What is this? 1998? Centering the cam like It's just ah, so silly. So silly. They do it that I've mentioned it before, they do it on purpose. To make the game harder to play. It's super silly. Yeah, these things are everywhere. Big one over here. Oh! Terrible! I've never seen that attack. I wanted to see it. <laughs> Honestly, I took a hit just because I wanted to see it. Although, I might have not been able to, to dodge it. Oh, there's so many hands. There's a bigger one. Oh, there's so many. I think while they're wriggling... Oh my god, there's so many. I think while they're wriggling, it's, uh... I'm gonna die here. I don't want to. I really don't. Freaking hell. Oh, then. While they're wriggling, it still counts as an attack. Ah. 
That was me getting saved by the crystals. <sighs> but I'm running out of uh, essence flasks, and that is a huge problem. Admittedly, I don't need to fight them. Glintstone Firefly. Oh! Oh! Okay, that was not too shabby. Because I have this. And I'll regenerate over time. But that attack, I think I got hit by the middle finger. Turns out you do not want to get hit by the middle finger. There's a lot of this remed crystal bud. And normal crystal buds. Trying to figure out where the hand is. Oh! Didn't expect it to jump that big, that fast. Look at that huge stake! Look at that steak of a hand. Just chunk of meat. I'm thinking these two hands are getting ready to throw themselves at me at the same time. And I don't want none of that. Our attack staggers them. These statues... They might help me out. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, too far. Seriously? Rolled again too far. It sucks. Double attack there, but it didn't matter. Oh, maybe sprinting around them might help. I didn't think about that. I didn't think about that, but it, it's too late now. I don't know where you were. Just sort of exploded out of the ground or something? Fell from, fell from the, the ceiling. It's all right. Yeah, I'm going to sprint around them. I think that might actually be the, the trick. Okay, the next one. Not not you. Not you. There's a lot of them. This is... This is all mad. There it is. Jump a little. Okay. Nope. Don't un unhook. Big statue. It's not that big. It's also the blimp that matters. So here is... Oh, are you che are you cheesable? Please be cheesable. I would mind. I would not mind the cheese. Big fan. That's the the, the, the targeting system is, is is cheesing me. This is what is happening. Did you see that? There it is. Oh, come on. Oh, that was not good. We got this. Uh, yeah, the targeting system is just... It is... So, what? The, something that Dark Souls 3... Dark Souls 2 already did it, and I'm pretty sure Dark Souls 1 as well did, but Dark Souls 3 does it multiple times. There are, they, they tuned the way the lock system unlocks automatically from enemies. They tuned it in a way that certain attacks just lose your tracking. Like, uh, an enemy jumps above you and you stop, and the camera doesn't rotate to follow the enemy. You just need to find the enemy again. Which feels very cool every once in a while, but in this particular instance, did you see how it was changing? It wasn't me changing it. How I was losing track of the, of the hand, it was not me doing it. 
it was the hands attacks. Just and 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 normally it isn't a problem. Oh, there's the big chunker that we heard from above. Normally it isn't a problem. Hey, that's me trying to, to lock on. But I can't. Don't worry, we got this. I said, don't worry, we got this. Uh, but that that time it was a huge problem because there were things under uh, behind it. Oh come on, that one doesn't work. Ooh, sprinting behind it and then power attacking. I like that. I like that. Now, I think... I do not know... Oh, there's another big hand over there. I was going to say, I don't know of any other big hand. It's only small hands now. But that's a lie. And for all I know, some of these are tougher than the others. For all I know, there's the handest of handiest hands. Oh, man, it's surrounded by these things. The redeeming quality here is that the uh let's try it Ooh. oh come on that is a good attack actually it's well devised okay um yeah, the redeeming quality is that... Well, I was going to say something about them being slower. The smaller ones. Oh, man, I really shouldn't... shouldn't be getting hit by them. Not that it's, you know, super easy. Look. It's blue, right? It's blue. Which means... No, it is not. This is an Ash thing. Carrion Piercer. Is that an Ash? It sounds like a spell. I'm pretty sure it is a spell. Maybe it's like anything? Like, if it isn't life or mana, it's anything. Hmm. I don't know. But it was like all rocky, so... Yeah, it's identifiable. That's good news. That's real great news. And an ice crest shield. This probably has to do with the uh, Ikri or whatever the other person's name was. Small metal round shield heavier than a wooden shield, but boasts higher damage negation. The ice crest originates from a carrion princess. Though the effect is sl slight, it boosts magic damage negation and resistance to frost. No info then. Let's move on then. 